today I'm pretty excited because we're going to Chick-fil-A not just for a chicken sandwich, but a meal kit. Stay tuned. facts right there. Look how much fat that is. Oh. Serves two in 25 minutes. Tells you everything you need to know right here. Looks like it's six steps. Get your cheese, lots of cheese, Alfredo sauce, nice and cold. And your tomato sauce, label right there. Pasta. Ooh, veggies. My favorite, but not my girlfriend's favorite. In this case, it's separate. It's um, already cooked and it's uh, spicy. Use or refrigerate, they say. I'm gonna start with the actual uh, chicken and the pasta. They can't mess this one up, right? It's chicken. Mm. Mm. Chick-fil-A never fails on the chicken. Mm. This chicken was in there for about 10 minutes. On the package it said 10 to 12, 10 to 12 minutes. And I think 
because I picked the spicy version, it was pre-made for you. So I didn't have to worry about cooking the chicken. But Chick-fil-A is like known for the chicken, so they can't really mess this one up. Hmm. I'm gonna get the instruction. Hmm. All right, guys, let's move on to the pasta. I did half a lime, lemon. I did half a lemon on it. Mm. And I only squeezed about half of my half, so if you like yours uh, really sour, then yeah, go out with a little bit first, because I only added just a little bit. It's, it's a little sour, I can taste it. Mm. Still delicious. It was crazy driving in to the actual Chick-fil-A line because you had two lines and you had these moderators that were there controlling the lines. And I was on my phone trying to vlog. And this guy come up, comes up to me and he's like, Hey man, you gotta move it up forward. So there's people like making sure you're in your line, moving up forward and, and that business keeps moving. The one thing that I like the most about it is that they have all the people working on the outside and there's very little people on the inside cooking your food. So very little um, bacterial uh, transfer to your food. I didn't have um, the actual oil spray to put into the foil so I used some um, olive oil and just kind of lightly um, lathered the uh, foil but you have oil spray that actually works so the cheese is going to stick to the foil so apparently Chick-fil-A was working on this for a long time I'm not sure what the dates were but it was a couple years I'm not sure how it stands for them on the business point but it works out for me because I can strip this grocery store. I don't have to deal with all the other people that might infect me if they have anything. And get my girlfriend a sandwich and have uh, dinner ready. Would you like your sandwich, baby? Yeah, thank you. Mm. The craziest part is that they don't handle your food from the window. They walk it out to you past the pickup window. It's like Chick-fil-A is taking extra steps. It's like Chick-fil-A is taking extra steps so that they can ensure that your food is sterile as possible. Mm. Thank you, Chick-fil-A. I love tomatoes. My girl hates veggies and tomatoes, so looks like the pasta's for me. It's kind of hot today, mid 80s. We're in Orange County. Had to keep the AC on. Thanks for all the for all the Chick Fil A workers that are outside cooking or um, actually getting the food out to us. Mm. Hopefully, you guys enjoy the review. If you enjoyed it, 
Click the button to subscribe. Give me a comment about what you think. But um, it's about fifteen dollars for this meal. Um, the spicy chicken really worked out. If you're in a rush and you're trying to get through the day and get a sandwich for lunch and then have something for dinner, it works out pretty well. It was fits within your budget. But it was pretty cake, pretty easy. All the instructions are here, one through six. Say about 25 minutes, was about 25 minutes, serves two. And I do recommend the spicy chicken. Ooh, I like spice. I was born in Thailand, so the spices are logo. Thanks for watching.